Hi guys! Okay, so today's video I'm just basically going to film a really quick update video and it's really weird filming on this because it's my vlog camera and again I can't see myself so I've put a mirror over there so I can see if I'm in, I'm in the angle etc. So I really don't know how people use these. Anyway, so I feel like I haven't just sort of chatted to you guys for a long time. Scarf's the mess. So I'm just going to talk in this video and you're hopefully going to listen to me. So basically if you follow me on Instagram on Facebook you'll see that I posted a lot of things to do with Sahara Shawl. There's my scarf pin. Uh, I knew it. Right, that's going in my pocket. Right, so you know I posted up a lot of things um, to do with Sahara Shawl, the Singaporean based company that make very innovative scarf designs. Um, so I've been working with them over the past month of January and basically as of next Thursday I will be flying out inshallah to Singapore to basically host an event in conjunction with Nadia, the designer from Sahara Shawl, um, on Saturday the 15th of February, inshallah, it's called a hijabi affair with Gina Tokyo and it's going to be a retro dress theme, so, so excited for that. And I will be in Singapore until... for a couple of days. Um, so the hijabi affair event, you had to buy tickets for it, I think they're all sold out. However, Nadia, the designer, is going to try and host a small um, just another small meetup event somewhere in Singapore. So if you follow her on Instagram, Sahara Shawl, and Facebook, Sahara Shawl, I'll leave the links in the description, um, and keep an eye out over the next week for updates on other meetups because honestly, we've got so many messages saying, oh, I couldn't get the tickets, really angry people. And it is a little bit frustrating because, you know, I would like to meet everybody. And I don't want anyone to feel upset that they um, aren't able to make um, a really cool event because hopefully you know the event is quite fun and a nice chance to meet loads of fellow friends. So and then inshallah I'll be going to Indonesia for a few days. I might try and do a meet up there. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to arrange that though. However, keep a lookout on my Instagram for details on a possible meet up somewhere in Indonesia. I don't know yet. I can't promise anything, but hopefully you never know. Anyway, and then on the way back from Indonesia. Back to the UK, we're going to stop off in Dubai for two nights because it's on the way back, so might as well. Might try and do a meetup in Dubai. However, I don't know, I'm a bit shy, really. And I am aware that the Arabs in the Arab world, like Dubai, Qatar, Saudi, Kuwait, etc., aren't really too fond of what I do or my style. They don't, they don't really like it. So, comment if you happen to be in Dubai. And you might you might be interested in a meetup. Maybe like ten of us could meet up, have a coffee or something like that. We'll see. I don't know because I'm really shy, but Sid is really encouraging me to do one because he's like, you should meet everybody that supports you, blah blah blah. And I'm just like, oh, I'm really shy. I don't like doing these things. But and I'm only shy when I think of it, but when I'm actually there meeting people, I'm really nice and sociable and I have a good time and then I'm always glad I did. It, or I was, I'm always glad I took part in something afterwards, but before it I always dread it, I don't know why. It's just me. And then inshallah, I'll have details of a London meetup. So a London meetup hopefully from March the 7th up until March the 17th. Sometime in that space, I'm going to arrange a London meetup. I hope, inshallah, we will see. And anyway, and then... A couple of months back I filmed a video on International Muslim Fashion Week. I'll leave the link below so you can have a look at the details for that. It's going to be a huge three day event, fashion show in Pennsylvania, um, America, USA, Hershey, Pennsylvania, that place over there. So anyway, um, alhamdulillah, finally being confirmed to attend that event. So on Tuesday the 18th of March I'll be flying out to Pennsylvania and I'll be there for three days if you haven't got your tickets. Um, make sure you do, I'll leave all the details below and you can also get a discount code by using my discount code that I've forgotten what it is but I will leave all the links in the description and all the details so please read the description because it's really important stuff anyway, the International Muslim Fashion Week Sahara Shaw will also be there so I'll be doing things with Sahara Shaw there as well hopefully, blogging with them um, and what else? yes, you can also, before they were selling tickets as a package so for the whole three days and the three nights, but now you can also buy one day passes, so, because there's three days of fashion stuff happening, so you can buy um, maybe just a ticket for the 20th or the 21st, or the 
23rd so now you can just buy a ticket for one day each if you don't want to go for the full three days or if you're unable to etc so hopefully i'll get to meet all the u.s ladies and whoever else flies out to us for the event for that event because it's going to be huge inshallah cannot wait for that and anyway after being in pennsylvania for three days i'm gonna be in new york for a couple of days maybe four or five days inshallah possibly with my sister so if that happens and if i have courage to i'll also try and arrange a meet up in new york inshallah so we'll see about that hopefully that will be fun but i don't know anything in new york or anywhere so i wouldn't know where to meet or what to do so maybe all the us ladies can help me with that as well what else and then we can film like a big super youtube video together or something i don't know that would be cool while i'm out in singapore i will try and vlog everything for you guys including the event and um try and vlog a lot of Sahara Shawl things. I'm going to visit their boutique, which is going to be epic because I just know them from online. So I'll try and vlog every day for you. I'll try and vlog every day in Jakarta as well. I'm not sure if they will go on my personal channel or the Sid and Dina channel. Probably the fashion related vlogs will go on my channel and then the vlogs where we're just out and about abroad will be on the Sid and Dina channel. So yes, there we go. So that's pretty much all the updates I wanted to talk about. Um, I look terrible. What is this? What is going on? Anyway, as you can see, I'm in Cardiff visiting the family before I... Oh, is it Daisy? Visiting the family before I go next week, inshallah. So, yes, I'm just wearing an old coat from Zara about four years ago. My sister's scarf. My sister's trousers and my old really scatty shoes that I found up in the attic. That actually need a good wipe down because they've got marks all over them. Anyway, whatever, Dina. Those are the updates I want to share with you. Also keep a lookout on our new channel, mine and Sid, Sid and Dina. I'll leave the link also for our first new video, which should be up by the time this is up actually. So have a look at that. We do, we've done the accent tag and we've also filmed the ghost chili pepper challenge. So we've got so many other ideas to film for you guys. Um, some of which will be um, question and answers from questions that you guys have actually emailed in asking for advice, etc., on marriage and multi multicultural marriage combinations and stuff like that so we will be doing those as well inshallah just give us a bit of time because you know it's a bit hard really with Sid working all day and me yeah so <laughs> I'm joking I do work but it's just my own work in it so that's anyway whatever so those are the updates guys um basically if this video was all a muddle it's because I can't see myself and I and this, I'm just saying what's happening because I'm really rushed and I've got so much to prepare in the next four days. It's unbelievable. I haven't, I haven't even got a suitcase yet. But anyway, read the description of this video because all the information I just shared will be in it. So there'll be a big paragraph for once in my life, inshallah. Anyway, without further ado, well, I will leave you to go for a poo. I'm joking. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time, keep it covered. Peace.